Hey, it's Jeff here with Bow River Trout Fitters. Today we're tying a Clouser Minnow with a little bit of a twist. We're using a size four hook here, five extra long. Wind our thread back. We're gonna run it back about halfway down the shank. We're using flat wax nylon. Uh, we'll bring our thread back up. We're using medium dumbbell eyes. Color is tire's choice here. I'm gonna hold the dumbbell eye at an angle and make several wraps just to attach to the hook. And then I'll cross over and I'll slowly try and get the eyes to sit perpendicular to the hook, wrapping tighter and tighter each time. I'll make a few wraps just going underneath the eyes and then I'll finish off with a little bit of head cement just to tack it down. We want the eyes far enough back that we have some room in front to attach our materials. Now that our lead eyes are on, we're going to apply our bucktail. Lead eyes are gonna make our fly ride hook point up. So we wanna put the bucktail on the top of the lead eyes. We're going to take about a quarter of an inch, a couple of loose wraps, just to collect the bucktail, and then we'll start to cinch it down as we wind forward towards the hook eye. Remember here that less is more. Now that we're over top of the eyes, we're going to wind back nice even wraps, just to form a bit of a body. Now that we've tied in the white bucktail, we'll flip our hook over, and we're going to tie in the olive. We're gonna use about three quarters of what we used in the white. We want a couple of collector wraps, same as before, and then we'll wrap forward, tightening the, the, the bucktail in as we go. We only attach the bucktail on the front of the eyes. Now we're going to tie the shimmer fringe in. Shimmer fringe has a light side and a dark side. This particular color is the peacock back. We wanna make sure that the dark side is on the top. That'll add a nice color to this fly. As we wind forward here, we're going to shape the head and eventually we'll finish off tying a couple of whip finishes and we'll apply a little bit of glue. We wanna make sure that we don't get any glue on the shimmer fringe as it'll make it brittle and it'll tend to break. We just want a little bit of glue to secure the wraps and that's about it. This is a great fly, it's quick tie, easy to do. It fishes really well in a river, swung or stripped as a streamer. If you tie this on a saltwater hook, this is a great saltwater pattern as well. You can get all these materials down at bullrivertroutfitters.com. Come on in and see us.